When we think of heroes, we usually think of feats of strength, superpowers, or maybe acts of sacrifice. American author Ernest Hemingway, however, uses a different set of qualities to define heroism, in essence creating a new hero archetype that has become known as the Hemingway Code Hero. The Code Hero consists of three qualities. The hero experiences a moment of truth, shows grace under pressure in it, and is often destroyed but not defeated. These ideas are tied to a sport that fascinated Hemingway, bullfighting. In this sport, a matador taunts a bull with a muleta, or red cape. As the bull keeps charging, its blood pressure rises, causing it to come dangerously near to having a heart attack and falling over dead before the show is over. In order to avoid this, the matador periodically stabs the bull with small harpoons called banderillas to let the blood out. When it is time for the final kill, the matador must slam a longsword or a stoke into the small triangle between the bull's shoulder blades. How the code hero archetype comes into bullfighting is this. First, a hero faces a moment of truth where things could go either way. It is dangerous for the hero. There could be great success or it could end poorly. Second, a hero shows grace under pressure in that moment. In other words, they keep their cool and don't panic. Finally, a hero may be destroyed but not defeated. That is, they don't back down even if it kills them. For instance, in one Hemingway short story, a kid matador has to fight five bulls because the two matadors before him both get gored and you can only have three matadors. He kills the first four bulls and gets to the last bull and is exhausted. He kills the bull, pukes, and falls over. Although he survives, he is destroyed, but not defeated because he never quits, making him a Hemingway archetype hero. So to sum up, the Hemingway hero faces a moment of truth, shows grace under pressure in it, and is sometimes destroyed but not defeated.